Today we're going to discuss the return of Eric Carlson and what this means for the Ottawa Senators. And that's coming up next. Hey everyone, what's going on? My name is Mike and welcome back to Top Shelf Hockey. If this is your first time here, we discuss all hockey items on this channel. We cover all NHL news, notes, highlights, trades, etc. And we cover all 31 teams. So if you're a huge hockey fan, consider subscribing. Having read into today's content, the Ottawa Senators just officially announced that the return of Eric Carlson is official and he will be returning to the lineup on Tuesday against the Vancouver Canucks. Obviously, this is great news for the Sens who have had to open their season without their captain and one of the league's best players. They have accumulated quite a record already though without Carlson going three wins, zero regulation losses, and two shootout losses to start the year. And they're coming off a three-game winning streak on, out of Western Canada against the Canucks, Flames, and Oilers. To make room for Carlson on the roster, the Senators have also made a few other moves, demoting rookie defenseman Thomas Shabbat to Belleville. Shabbat certainly played well in his appearances with the Senators so far, but is purely a victim of the numbers game. The Senators have way too many defensemen on one-way contracts and can't risk losing one of the other guys on waivers. So Shabbat will go down to Belleville. I'm sure he'll play well down there, but he certainly will be getting another shot as soon as he'll have room for him. In other news, they've also sent Alex Formanton back to the OHL. So he'll return to junior for the remainder of the season. He certainly had a bright uh, training camp, but things looked really solid for the young speedster. He's also got into one NHL game, only playing a limited five minutes, but he looks strong in his appearance and I'm sure he'll be getting another crack in the near future as early as next year. So the Sens have already had a very strong start to the season and now they get to return to their captain and one of the league's best players in Eric Carlson. That should give them an even bigger boost. I'm sure that the, as a team on the bench they'll feel much more confident with Carlson around. I know he's such a huge part of the team's success. I fully expect Carlson to line up alongside Johnny Oduya. Oduya was certainly signed in the offseason mainly to replace Mark Mathot and play with Carlson. The Sens fans tell me, are the Sens going to take one of their other defensemen out of the lineup? And if so, who? Is it going to be Clayson, Boro, Weidman, or are they going to continue playing with the 11-7 route that they've had so much success with in the last road trip? Obviously, it would be nice to see Logan Brown get back in the lineup, as he would be the extra forward, but the 11-7 combo has certainly worked well for the Senators in the last three games. So Eric Carlson's back for the Senators. If you're excited about this, give this video a thumbs up. If you're a big hockey fan and want to keep up with all the latest news, consider subscribing, and I'll be talking to you soon.